Hey, and welcome back to Food Cooker. So today what we're going to make, we're going to make Tata de Solomon. Tata Solomon is uh, very easy to make and it's really easy to digest and you can serve it with a salad. It's just perfect. And so Now as summer is coming in and everybody wants to get this going, so this is the perfect thing to have is Tata de Solomon, okay, with salad. So now what do we need for to do a tata de somo? We need nice fresh salmon. This is wild salmon. So if you're in Quebec or in Canada or somewhere up in the mountains where you can find fresh, wow, go for this recipe, I, I'm telling you. So now we start with the recipe. What do we need? You need some lime, some lemongrass paste, some chopped, finely chopped pickle, finely chopped pesi, finely chopped garlic, and finely chopped onions. Then you need some nice green salad. Then what you can do just to decorate your salad plate, you can cut some tomatoes or whatever you like. When you like a uh, creamy tea, whatever creamy tea you like, you put on your salad and then we have some paste here for, for the decoration. Then you need some tomato ketchup, some alcohol, I, uh, cognac, this is Keef, this is Swiss alcohol, it's made by the Swiss and the speciality only comes from Switzerland, it's called quiche. I like putting quiche. So, here we go. First we're going to make the sauce, so you take a bowl like this. Okay, so now we're going to put some ketchup into this bowl, not much. Some ketchup. Some mus mustard, not much, like this, it's enough. And we're going to take an egg, only take the yolk from the egg. Put a little bit of olive oil, some lime, some pepper, some salt. Then we're going to put in our lemongrass paste and we're going to mix it well. We're going to make it a nice thick sauce. So once that, we're going to take some quiche. One cup. It's enough. So it seasons the fish well. Then we're going to take our onions. Our garlic, our chopped pickles. And here we mix them again. If you like chilies, you can put chilies. So we let that marinate for about 10 15 minutes, and the onions get into the lemon and everything. Then we're going to put a little bit of chopped paste, finely chopped paste. And we're gonna mix it. So while that's sitting, we are gonna take our salmon and we're gonna finely chop it. It has to be really chopped finely. You see this wild cinnamon, see the color? Wow, what a beautiful color it gives you. Now if you like the recipe and the quantity, you can come to foodcooker.com. Wow, look at that. It's really nice and chopped well. Now what we are going to do with the salmon, we are going to drop it into our sauce. Wow. And we continue mixing it.
uh, once it's well mixed like this, now a somo is almost ready to be served. Now we have a plate ready like this. You can put any garnish what you want, any decoration. That's not a problem. Now we, if you have a big one, you can find this in the market. It's really handy to keep. I prefer a bigger one, so I take a bigger one. Then next, we're going to place our salmon just over here. Wow, look at that. Well, once that's in, just have a bit of chopped tomatoes, just to give it the color. Just a lime, you can just poke in a lime. I like to poke in it this way. Wow, look at that. You have a nice... Next, we're gonna take our green salad. Just to decorate it, you can put some tomatoes. You can decorate any way you want. I prefer doing it this way. Look at that. Now, this vinaigre, uh, this dressing, salad dressing, if you like, you have it on my website. And you can do it before you make the tata. Then we're going to dress a little bit of dressing around. So, now you have a nice tata sumo from Jerry Food Cooker. You have a good, you can decorate it as you like. You can make some nice small fishes. So thank you for passing your time with me to make a nice tata sumo to enjoy what? Eating it. So now we start with the sumo you can make and I'm sure you can make it. So know what we need to serve with it. We have some nice bread. And this is the perfect meal. A nice tasa de sumo with nice fresh brown bread. Thank you and welcome to Jerry Food Cooker. Come to my website for your recipes. Bye bye.